Okay, ec so you've, you're either buying cheaper, buying differently, sell selling higher, or bringing in different routes, different amounts of stock to the same marketplace, which is your buyer. Also, and we're going to talk about this in customers, is have investors fled? At the moment, not, my, not around me. No. Not around you, no. And at the moment, yes. Down our way, yeah. it's gone quiet. So, so you're when you're south, selling out, so no, I've just been selling a property, and normally we would have had investors crawling all over <laughs> it. And at the moment, what we've got is um, downsizers. But the, the investors are actually very noticeable by their absence. So at the moment, in, so, in, in the south, noticeable by their absence. In Stoke, which you might say is... 50% on 55,000 isn't going to rock the boat. Yeah. So for cheaper <laughs> purchases, you've got a, still got a large investor market. Whereas, um, what's the average price point that you'd be dealing with? Well, I'm selling that one out at 400,000. So I'm normally the 350, 400. Yeah, so that's a wee bit more expensive. So again, you note the different economic... Cha um, um, actions depending on price point and geography what anyone else have investors disappeared or are they still in the marketplace i wish i could, could be trading you know three fifty four hundred pound thousand pound houses um i'm like what three percent because it only starts at 40 grand uh, i bought a house on friday for 18. <laughs>